Right now, Seattle police are looking for the shooter who killed a young woman among hundreds of people partying in the Capitol Hill neighborhood. Thank you for joining Fox 13 News at 10. I'm Frankie Thompson. The shooting happened around 1.30 this morning in the 1400 block of 11th Avenue near Union Street. Fox 13's Dave Detling joins us from the newsroom tonight with the latest on the investigation. Good evening, Frankie. Well, details are very limited tonight. No suspect description and no indication as to why this woman was shot. SPD now relying on the possibility of surveillance footage in the area as well as public tips. Shots heard 1427 11 and a half, one minute ago, three gunshots heard. Dispatch audio from Citizen App alerting police in Capitol Hill that a shooting just occurred. The call coming in around 1.30 in the morning, Saturday. I call see someone down on the street. Businesses in the area telling Fox 13 off camera, a guy working security at one of the open businesses heard those gunshots and saw the victim fall to the ground. A local bartender telling me off camera, he too called 911. According to this Seattle Police Department press release, when officers arrived in the 1400 block of 11th Avenue, they found a 25-year-old woman with multiple gunshot wounds. They say she'd been shot in the chest. Officers tried to save her life, but she did not survive her injuries. People off camera telling Fox 13 the shooting happened directly in front of this parking garage attached to Chop House Row. Police aren't sure what led up to the shooting and say no one is in custody. They are hoping surveillance cameras in and around the neighborhood help investigators track down the person responsible. And tonight, police are asking anyone with information to give them a call at 206-233-5000. Now, you can also reference the incident and case number for that police report. It is 24-29-65-74. In the newsroom tonight, Dave Detling, Fox 13 News.